So recently, these gay YouTubers called Greg and Mitch released a video called Why You Shouldn't Have Kids, and it was a hyperbolic title where they basically just informed you of some of the negatives if you do decide to have kids, and they'd let you come to the conclusion. They even said in the video that they're not going to stop you if you want to. So, of course, the rational paleo-libertarian sector of YouTube reacted to this by calling it anti-child propaganda or something like that. Like, just looking at some of these comments are funny. But don't worry, some people went beyond comments and made full videos. One of them is no bullshit. And I hope you hate bullshit because this guy doesn't like it either. He made a video called, Two Gay Canadians Say We Shouldn't Have Kids. That's a kind of oversimplification of the video, but okay. Okay, first off, the way the guy talks just kind of annoys me. He talks to you in kind of a patronizing way. It's hard to explain, but it's like he talks to you. I, I can't do an impression similar to it. But it especially shows through whenever he tries to make any sort of big statement. He sits there and goes, why don't you know I'm right? It feels like he's talking to you. Like you just have so little intelligence. He just thinks everyone who is behind is just idiotic, because that's exactly what he thinks. And it really is patronizing to his viewers. And for that matter, if you're a viewer of his, I imagine it's going to get on your nerves after a while. Like, oh god, I, I agree with him, but he's still talking to me like I'm stupid. Oh. But anyway, enough um, tone policing. Let's get into the actual points, which this man really doesn't have. His entire rebuttal really comes down to, well, if you want to have kids, this wouldn't be that big of an issue. Um, which I guess is true. Good thing Greg and Mitch agree with you on that. Like, seriously. <laughs> They even said that in the video. At one point, he says Can Canada is communist. That's pretty stupid. Um, I mean, he probably thinks anyone to the left of Reagan is a communist, but you know. The last thing of note is he ends the video blatantly promoting white genocide conspiracies. <laughs> he actually promotes the idea that having mixed race children and things like that is white genocide. Ignoring the fact that isn't even close to what actual genocide is. Um, he also specifically states that it needs to be white conservative children. Um, because if you can't defeat them, you outbreed them. And wait, isn't that a quote from the Quran? That's odd, because one of the groups he says is replacing white people as Muslims. You stole their strategy! Anyway, I found one other video on this that I thought was worth talking about, and that's by Lauren Southerns, who, just like the last guy, is defending having kids and doesn't have any kids. Logical. Now, she actually does go through and debunk statistics instead of going, Well, you see, the entire time, which is better than the last guy. However, the only other thing worth noting about her is at one point when Greg and Mitch mentioned that having less people would actively reduce the amount of carbon in the air. Lauren Southerns takes that as well. Why don't we all just kill ourselves then? To think someone actually said that and thought, Got him! 
Um, the only real point, other point she addresses around that segment where she talks about how basically um, these people want to bring in all these African children, these Indian children. When Greg and Mitch actually mentioned the video, one person in the U.S. is about as much as 106 people in the 80s. So what Lawrence Southern would have to do is she'd have to prove there are more than 106 times the people in Hades as there are in the United States. Which would imply there were more people than I think there even would be on Earth. Her video was overall better than No Bullshits, but it was still... Hers was just more generic, while No Bullshit just had a few moments that were... Oh, God, that was awful. Anyway, that's it. I'm Ephraim, and good night.